And we are back to this game. Um, so before starting the recording, obviously I did a little bit of travel and I got to this place, which is kind of just an unremarkable island. Um, let me pull up the map here actually, just so you can see it. Um, it is right here. I've been to this island before. There was a hero statue, I blew it up. That's basically all you need to know. So, um, when I got here last time, I couldn't progress because I didn't have the bracelet. Now I have that, so I should actually be able to do this room. And, um, from the previous hero statue, I believe I got a, uh, magic container. And from last episode's exciting adventure with running out of magic, I think getting another magic container would probably be in my best interest. But first, we got a whole bunch of land molas, apparently. Um, and these things do two hearts of damage in one hit, which is concerning, so maybe picking them off from a distance is the best way to go here. It's like, I've got frickin' money for days in this game, so I don't really care if I have to waste arrows. But yeah, I'm gonna try to, um, basically just do some exploring here. I know of a couple other Link statues that I haven't blown up yet, uh, that are on my map. So I'll check those out. And then, um, I guess just start looking at new areas. I'm pretty sure, I didn't actually review the footage to verify this, but I'm pretty sure the, uh, Great Fairy told me to go to the Swamp Island next, and I've explored almost all of that, so I could just go there and do the next level, but... Eh? I don't know. Let's, uh, take a moment here and check the map again and see where it is I'm actually going. Um, I did look at the footage to see that for this one I need the ladder, so I wrote that down, so I still can't do that one. Um, there's another statue over here, which I can get to if I go to the desert island and then kind of go through all that garbage. Um, there was another one up here, which I can get to from the snow island, or I can just get to it from this one. So I think I want to go to the desert island, which is going to be a bit of a trek, but it has to be done. So yeah, we'll do that, and then, um, hopefully at least one of those will be completable. Obviously, I don't know what items they're going to require, but we can always hope. So, um, hold on, my freaking map is uncovered. Do I want to go... Okay, so I want to hold right at the intersection, and then, yeah. Okay. Sorry, it's really hard for me to, like, manage all these screens at once. As I've stated on numerous occasions, I could very well try to play this in Beta 184, where the map doesn't crash after opening it a second time. But, uh, what fun would that be? Oh, wait, probably quite a bit more fun. Okay, so here we're at the desert. We got a lot of uh, beautiful ocean noises. Hopefully just kind of get our way through this area without too much of a dramatization. Clearly that's the word I meant to use, I don't know. Kind of killing these in hopes of getting magic. I don't need any magic right now, but I want to at least prove that it can be done. Problem is they take four sword hits. Could also use the white sword. I'm not sure when I get that. I want to say in like the first video, there was somebody who apparently knew this quest fairly well and like offered to give me hints and they said like, if you want to know where the white sword is, I'll tell you. I'm trying my best to get through this on my own. Um, but yeah, a sword upgrade would be nice. Because I'm guessing the hero statues always give the same thing. Which I'm fine with. I like consistency. Um, so there's maybe like a little mini level somewhere that I've missed. I don't know. Do I need anything from the shop? I don't think I do. 
Yeah, I've got max super bombs, so this is fine. Okay, so down from here, we should have a new statue to blow up. Yes, indeed. Okay. And it turns out I can't even reach it. I didn't actually look at the... Oh, Okay, I'm going on a journey. Luckily, it wasn't a very long journey. That might be a mini level there, but I need the hook shot for it, so. Doesn't matter even if it is. Shit, yeah, I need the hammer for this. I didn't realize that. Okay, so much for that. Um, how about the other one? Can that one be reached? Can this Zora, like, fuck off? Anyway, going on a bit of a journey again. I also don't know when I get the flippers. I know that definitely opens up the overworld a bit more. Okay, this path... What does this lead to? Hold on. Uh, that leads to... the swamp, so I don't want to take that yet. There is a screen above this that I can turn on that I haven't done yet, though. So I'll probably do that after I try to get to this next statue here. Which I also can't do because I need the hammer. Okay. I'm very glad that I paid attention to my map. Oh well. Well that just means uh, our exploring is over sooner than planned. Can I turn up here? Yes I can. I've also not been this way yet. So this is heading into new territory. I see uh, Desert Island has like extended its reach across the land to start including other areas. Also, screen wrap. Because um, I am on the far right side of the screen here, and this is going to loop me back to the other end. Have I been here? Hold on. I want to say I actually have, um, yeah, actually, I think I have, hold on, it's, again, I can't actually have, oh, there's money, okay, I can't actually have the map open while I'm looking at the game, um, without, well, here, I'll just, stretch this down a little bit. Sorry, this is really annoying. I, I don't mean to subject everybody to this garbage. Okay. See, so yeah, I have been here. Um, somehow I feel like this isn't lining up. No, I guess it is. Okay. But yeah, this will lead to some purple area that I don't think I can do anything with. Yeah, that's where I need the ladder. Okay, so we're not going to do that. How about up here? This is a dead end. Dead ends are always fun. But yeah, just so you have an idea of how I'm, like, handling this, because I need the game and the map open at the same time, um, because the game window is naturally so small and there's no way for me to actually enlarge it, um, what I do is I play with the... Um, I basically look at the preview window in OBS as I'm playing, because I can use that to kind of make it bigger. And so I have that taking up a good chunk of the screen. Oh, come on, really? I just want to make sure that these don't drop money. Um, and then I have the map open next to that, and I have the game itself actually open on the second monitor so that it's not being blocked by anything. So I'm just kind of trying to manage my like screen space here. don't know how I knew that was going to do anything. Also, why did I even bother? I don't need money. Okay. Um, good, I'm glad I did it. Oh, well. Here, let me frickin' do one more bit of screen management. Slide this shit over. Okay, we're good. So, I guess we're just exploring then. Like I said, I don't really want to do Swamp Island yet, if I can help it. 
overworld exploration is a good thing. So let's take a right at this next opportunity here, and this will lead to something new. Maybe. Actually, have I done here? Hold on. I haven't been to this specific screen yet. I have, however, been on the screen wrapped other end of it, I think. Yeah, isn't this where I needed isn't this the statue that I blew up where I needed the ladder? Maybe. Kinda hard to tell. You know what else I need? A shield. That would be nice. Yeah, this is the one that I can't do yet. And there's money that I can't really hold, so I'm just going to leave it there. Is this something that can be blown up? I'm going to feel really stupid wasting a super bomb on it. But you know what? Whatever. It is. Okay. Not what I was expecting. Okay, this is an eyeball combo. This is not, so... You are immediately suspicious to me. Mm, I would say let's not do this yet, but it's going to respawn when I come out of it because it's a dungeon D map, so... Let's see where this takes me. I have fires. I don't think I've seen those yet. So, is this going to be like an entire stage? Hmm. Now, this looks like a room straight out of freaking, like, Big Dips Adventure 1 or Mitch. Just. Who needs block puzzles? You can just fill the room with garbage. Oh. Actually, hold on. No, this is even more so. Yeah, this is definitely Mitch, because I like to freaking make invisible mazes for some reason. <laughs> that was weird. I've not seen my shitty design in other games that often. Let's not get murdered by Stealthos 2s. But yeah, wasn't really planning on doing a dungeon this early in the video, but it's not the dungeon I thought it would be, so fuck. So I'm okay with it for now. Um, fighting dark nuts in extremely small corridors. Always my idea of a good time. Also, can we get these wall masters to come back? Will I get a key in this room? I see that bombable wall on the right, so it's not a dead end. Usually when I see a dead end, I think it's going to leave an item, but uh, if it has another purpose, then... Nope, okay. So, so far I've taken uh, two staircase warps, so I really have no idea where anything is in relation to each other. Always a good start. Here's a bunch of blue Gorias, which are pieces of shit that I don't want to have to fight, because they have 5 HP. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, and item bubbles. <laughs> I can't tell if uh, this level is above my current uh, difficulty level or not, because there hasn't really been a consistent difficulty level in this game. And we'll just roll with it. Item? Nope, another staircase warp. Or passageway, technically, is what they're called. Good old screen 81. So, I'm trying to think uh, what I could possibly get from this stage. Obviously, I don't know, 
like what items are in dungeons, so I don't really have any way to judge that, but assuming it's just an upgrade of some kind, I'd be happy with a sword. Um, a ring. A ring would definitely be nice. I kind of... Fuck off! I kind of doubt it's a shield. Because you can... I am going to freaking die. I cannot do this. Okay. Um... Can I... I think I just want to follow it. Like... that. This freaking sucks. How do you get through this? <laughs> there is not enough space for that. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think it's going to be a shield because you can lose those from like likes. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you think there's enough dark nuts in this room? Um. Fuck me. I don't even mind dark nuts usually. Um. There's another door I can go through. I guess we'll check that real quick. I can maybe grind for health in here. Maybe, if I don't just lose all of it from the cell phoses. That's a one-way door, okay. Enemy spam, the level. <laughs> Part of my plan for, like, part of the reason I was playing this game in the first place was because, um, obviously I've had, like, the Victips Adventure 3 stuff on my mind and planning stuff out, and I wanted to, like, try just another 192 quest just to kind of see what it did and if I could, like, take inspiration from it or whatever. Like, I'm not looking for something to rip off specifically, but just, like, if there would be any, like, design choices that I can make use of. Um, and I remembered this one being pretty good. I'm starting to maybe think otherwise. It's not bad, but it's also not as great as I remembered. Um, now, this is a side level, and it's not specifically meant to be completed right now. So I can't say that it's too hard. Like, I could just not do it and come back later with... Oh, shit. I'm used to bombs not damaging you. Um, could come back later with better equipment. But I'm also hoping that this place gives me said better equipment. So, I don't know. Fucking Christ. I think the the slash is throwing me off too because I'm I'm used to having the the forward stab, and with like with dark nuts you can kind of cheese them a bit if you just stand perpendicular and attack. I don't know if that works with the slash. Let's see. I mean it does from this angle, but what if what if it's on the side that the sword isn't swinging? It does. Okay, good. So I can make use of that. And the thing is, I know these enemies are going to respawn, like, the next time I come in here. I don't actually know how enemy respawning... I don't actually know how enemy respawning works in Zelda Classic mechanics. Maybe the fact that the bubbles are in there will prevent them from coming back, I don't know. But yeah, apparently I didn't need to kill them at all. Also, I'm uh, really enjoying these things taking pot shots at me over there when I can't actually do anything about it. Okay, maybe I can. Please? Please? Okay. Okay. 
I guess I found the boss room. So, boss room is push the block in the dark nut room at the beginning. But I still need the key. Because this is a boss door, I would assume that would make sense. Um, I didn't actually try rubbing up against the door yet to see if it takes a normal key. Bah! Bah! I still need to make a new sound effects pack. I keep forgetting to do that. Like, I'll, I'll usually remember it right before I start one of these videos, and then it's like, well, I can either start the recording now, or I can spend five hours putting together a bunch of stupid sound effects. Yeah, let's see. I think I want to probably not do that. Um, that looks like I need the hammer. Why does everything require the hammer? And if you're going to require the hammer in this level, maybe make it so I need the hammer to get in. That might be nice. Um, like, that could be an optional chest. I don't know. I don't like it. And I kind of doubt the hammer is in this level. Like, it might be. But that doesn't seem like an optional item. That seems like something I'd get from a main dungeon. I don't know. I mean, we'll keep exploring, I guess. Why is this tile different? Is that a item appears here spot? Just freaking kill everything with arrows at this point. I don't care. Yes, it is. Okay. Not really that helpful, because I already knew where the boss was, but okay. I guess so. Oh, shit! That sucked. I couldn't have done anything about that. Also, there's a freaking lot of one-way doors in this place. And we're back in the Dark Knight room, which thankfully they have not respawned in. Okay. So I can't go up from here. Um... If I go this way, that door doesn't open, right? I don't think it did. No, alright, so... This is basically just a pointless loop. Oh, shit! Why was I on super bombs? I didn't... What? I guess I hit L too many times. That sucks. Okay. Either way, that would have just looped back to... <sighs> Didn't realize that door shut behind me. That was a waste of a freaking super bomb. And I guess I can just go buy more. I needed to do that anyway, but still, though. Just trying to learn the dungeon. And not get killed by everything. Okay, so we definitely want to take this warp here. Because I think there were some paths I didn't take, and I mean, I died at the end of this path anyway, so I don't know what it was going to lead to. So far, I've found a chest that I can't open because I don't have the item for it. And a door that I can't open because I need the boss key. Something's gonna t something's telling me that chest is probably gonna have the boss key. And yet the uh, hammer is most likely not actually in this dungeon. So why am I still in here? I'm not sure. Everything dies. Okay, so... Pfft. Good thing I got invincibility frames there. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. No! God damn it. When your room has, like... 
twenty percent of the available space walkable. Why would you spam like six enemies on it? But yeah, as I was saying, um, I was looking at this for like, I was gonna be looking at this quest for like possible inspiration and design ideas. Um, I'm now, I'm taking something away from it. I'm I'm learning what not to do. Enemy spam is bad. Fuck. Oh, this sucks. I have a potion. I just don't want to use it because I'm just going to have to restart anyway, so. Let's kill the wall masters. Go away. Three, four, five. Okay. And we're back at the Stelphos room. Okay. So that was pointless. Let's just freaking continue warp, get a little bit of health back. What else have I learned other than enemy spam is bad? That's my that's my main thing. One day I'll learn the path through this room. Helicopters exist. That's the other thing I've learned. Ugh. Just don't drop enough hearts. Shit! One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Um, no, I don't want to go left. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Use them invincibility frames. Oh my god, this sucks. Something drop a fairy, for the love of God. Okay, you're dead. <sighs> no. I don't want both of you on me. Okay. Drop a heart, or a fairy, please. Do it. Do it. Nope. Okay. And in this room, do we die? No, there's no enemies in here. Okay. I've already gone up. Was that a staircase room, or did I die in that room? I haven't been down. It's probably gonna freaking be a shutter door, and I won't be able to go back. Yup. No! Things I should be cutting out, but I don't want to, because I, I, I I'm gonna keep going. We're gonna get through this. I mean, we're probably not gonna get through this because it's probably not beatable, but I mean, I can freaking try. Why do I never remember the path through this? I'm just gonna try to ignore all the enemies in the rooms that I've already cleared out. It's difficult because actually now I'd like to get hearts back. Except now I'm yeah, I'm losing weight. Oh. Okay. Now if I can not get murdered by the dark nuts in here. Which is a bit of a tall order, I realize. Oh <laughs> damage boost through the wall masters. Whatever has to be done. Okay. And in here, not die to the bats. God damn it. Okay. We're, we're moving into new rooms. This is good. Let's have a room with like five walkable tiles in it and th stick a bunch of enemies in. At least it was only three. It could have been like 30. I mean, it can't actually be because the limit per room is 10, but still. Ugh. Every time I go in a staircase, I'm like, item room? Please? No, it's not. 
It'll never be an item room. Okay. Blue Gorias, I hate you. Because you have too much health. Item. Map, okay, that's at least slight. Oh god, this place is big. Oh. Oh, I don't care for that at all. Okay, hold on. Um, so I can go left from here, or I can go up from the room down and left from me. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can go left from here. And we're back in this room. So, I'm trying to think where I haven't been. Um, there's the... Oh wait, this is just the boss room, isn't it? Yeah, I can't actually do this yet. Shit. And I can't do this yet. And this just leads back to the beginning, I think. What I want to do is go back to the room with the slashable curtains and then go up from there and then see where I haven't been in that direction. Because I think that's where I died the first time. No. Yeah, I don't need to kill these again. Okay. Oh, oh, yep, 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 yep. I haven't been up from that screen. Um, I don't know if that door opens. Okay, so it's not just the boss room. It takes you on a bit of an adventure. I need to try that again. Because I don't think I've been up from that one. Not like you can frickin' tell. Because there's no time to think. The thing that sucks about that room is the fact that there's no way to, like, dodge the attacks. Because due to the way the walkability on the tiles works, and the fact that, like... What the shit? Um... I don't know what I'm saying. I can't think. Like, it, I, I'm dedicated... Oh, did I want to go this way? No, I didn't. I've, I'm forgetting what I'm doing. I'm going crazy. I just, I want to know for sure if I can finish this place. If I, if I explore every possible avenue, and there's no way to get past it because I need the hammer, then fine. Like, at least I know to come back later. But if I get the hammer in here, then I'd want to get that, na get that now because that opens up a lot of stuff. Fucking enemy spam! Heart! 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 <laughs> stop, stop. Okay. This isn't where I wanted to be, but I'll take it. Um, because I don't remember where this led to. I just have to not touch anything and ignore the siren. Always a siren. Okay, what do we have in this room? Oh, it's this goddamn room. Yeah, this is why I couldn't get past. Okay. I'm going to be pissed off if I die here anyway. Hold on, you guys get out of the way. Okay. Shh. And they do a full heart whenever you touch them. Okay, go. Go. 
Just fucking damage boost, I don't care. Oh, this is a pleasant looking room. I like this one. Got four wall masters and six like likes. At least they're not shooting at me. And at least they're not dark knots. Do I get anything from killing them? I mean, I'll take like a random fairy drop, that would be nice. I'd rather not have to use another potion. I think these enemies have enough health. No, okay. Uh, this game doesn't have walkthrough walls, does it? I hope not. What did this room do for me? I've been to the right of this. Hold on. Oh. Up to this point, every bombable wall has been marked. What is this bullshit? Oh my god. Okay, I need to do some off-screening here. Did I save after getting that magic upgrade? No? Okay, I guess I'm getting that again. So yeah, I'm just going to restart everything, because this sucks. And I didn't want to lose all that stuff that I used, so yeah. Okay, so I've made the decision um, that I value my sanity, and I don't want to do that level again. It's... I, I, I could probably try to get a little bit farther in it. For all I know, like, I was two steps away from getting into the door that would have given me an item that I needed. I'll check it out at some other point. I am tired of its shit right now, though. So we're going down this way, because I've never actually been in this direction. Okay, that was a good visit. I like that. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm not really sure what to expect here. Uh, have I been... No, I've not been anywhere in this place. Let me go straight here, and then I'll probably take that downwards turn the next time I pass through. Well, there's another hero statue. I can maybe do that. I can turn left here if I want. I would like to land on this island, though. Uh, are we going to be able to? This is quite the path you're taking me on. Okay. So I've got several paths I haven't taken here. Um, but first, let's do this because magic upgrades usually a good thing. At this point, I don't need a magic upgrade nearly as much as I need a freaking ring or sword. Honestly, even just a shield at this point would be nice too, so I can block half of the attacks that are being shot at me. But. Uh, I mean, of the options, the shield would be my least wanted. Yeah, this Zora is really making its presence known. Because it's like, I've got all this other enemy spam to deal with, and then there's just random fireball appearing out of nowhere, because it keeps disappearing behind the tree layers. Alright, you die. Just making sure it doesn't drop money. And will I be able to complete this one? Or will it require the hammer like everything else in this game? Hammer or ladder? One or the other. Now let's not blow ourselves up with the super bomb this time. Okay. What do we got? Hook shot? What is this? After I kill the oh, after I kill the whiz robes, I'll be able to maybe tell. I assume the white blocks are hookshot targets. I don't see any other way that this room would be doable. 
Also, um, OBS is not capturing the, uh, flickering of these wizards properly, so they appear way later for me than they actually are. Um, I'm now having to look at the actual game window, which is really small. You want to, like, appear over here so I can kill you? Oh, okay. I don't know why I'm bothering to kill this thing, because it's not going to do anything for me, but there. Yeah, I cannot do this yet. Great. Okay. And more hookshot. So I'm starting to think maybe I should have just done the Swamp Island and not tried to, like, go off on a different adventure here. That's what I've learned today is, uh, don't trust white eight now. Um, basically, just adventuring is bad. Do what the game tells you to and don't think for yourself. I don't know. I feel like I don't necessarily want to be doing level four with six hearts and this sword. This game seems to be really, uh, like stingy with its heart paces, though. I've still only found two of them. I mean, I've found others, I just can't reach them. Alright, where is this to take me? Dark Island? Or Death Island? Yeah, that's what it's called. I don't think I'm ever going to be getting there. Well, I mean, eventually I will, but not for a while, at least. Yeah, is this going to take me back to... Hey, look, Hammer! Um... Yeah, this was the first path that I said I wasn't going to take. I think there's a left I can take here, though. Yeah. This is just going to be the frickin' swamp. Yes. All roads lead to the swamp. Okay. Um. So, let's briefly look at this map again. Um. So that was from here. I went down, basically filled out this section a bit, took a left, and it dumped me off at this dock here, so I've been to that. Uh, down here, I think this blue dot is a skull, maybe? I'm not actually sure what that is. That looks like that's a heart paste that I should be able to get. There's got to be something blocking it, though. Let's see what it is. I'm right here, so... Uh, wait. Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely a heart pace. What's blocking it? Okay, cool. Wait, what did that... What did that do? Okay, I made a shortcut. I'm... I can take... I'll accept that. Do you sell shields? Oh god, thank you. Okay. That is an expensive-ass shield. But, whatever. I need it. So, basically now I just need to remember that, uh... What I, what I should probably just do is save right now before I freaking lose this thing to a like-like, because if I lose this shield, I'm resetting. Like, I I absolutely am not going to pay another 275 rupees for another shield. Um, but let me look at the map again. Okay, so we got that. Um, this obviously screen wraps over. I haven't been on this screen for whatever reason, so I should go do that. Uh, I have not been up there. I can check that out. And on the other end of the map... No, I don't want to click on the game. There's another heart piece that I can probably get with the bracelets. So that's something I should do. Um, there's the dungeon, obviously, which I'll get to at some point. Okay, so I've got a heart piece. I've got an unexplored screen, and I've got a raft that I've not done. 
So let's try and do that. Not that I can see the entire map, but uh, we'll try. Yeah, I can't see shit. Hold on. <laughs> okay, no, this is fine. Is this a different shop? No, this is the same shop. Okay. I'm trying to tell where I am. I'm sorry. I know this is really obnoxious. Um, the map has to be so zoomed out for me to see it. I can't tell where I'm going. So I think to the left here is the screen I've not visited. It sure is just a screen on the swamp. <laughs> or no, it's like maybe this was the one. I don't know. Yeah, I think that was the screen. Okay, so that did nothing. Heart piece. Let me try and get that, because this is the... Up here, this is the raft path I've not taken yet. I'm kind of curious where that goes, but let me get the heart piece first. Also, is the Star Fox Adventures music again? Kind of sounds like it might be. There it is, okay. I should be able to get that, right? Are you a push W? Or a push HW, I mean? Probably. Which means I have to spend time killing P-Hats. Because those are my favorite enemies to have to fight. Either you're a push HW or you're a push W2. If it's a W2, or I mean a H2. If it's an H2, then I can't do it. Because H2 requires the uh, level 2 bracelet. Come on. Today. <laughs> this is why P hats freaking suck. They're not hard enemies, they just make you wait for like 7 days. If I leave the screen and come back, are you going to become a moblin? Okay, there we go. Please be a push HW. Nope, it's not. Okay, we can't get that heart base. That's garbage. Would have liked a seventh heart. But no, it was not meant to be. There's still that one on the snow island, too, that was like... I had to find, like, a hidden cave somewhere. I might have to check that out again, too. I don't know. I might want to come back with the Lens of Truth if it's just bomb a random wall. Okay, where do you take me? Well, the rain stopped. Um. Oh. Wait, what? No, I don't... Okay. I don't want to be here at all. This is just... I've already been here. Okay. Yeah, I've been this way. I mean, there was some money I guess I can get. Or wait, was there? No, this isn't where the money was. That was like a desert screen. Oh, this game. So, basically, uh, this has been, like, what am I at, like, 40, 50 minutes, and I've not done anything. <laughs> I got a heart piece. That's something. It's not really something, is it? Oh, I bought a shield. I had an awful time in a dungeon. I learned that enemy spam is bad. Let me at least get this money again. So yeah, this is uh, this is one of those times where it being a semi-blind playthrough is not a great thing because if I knew about the game beforehand, I could kind of plan for this shit and be like, okay, we don't want to actually explore the world yet, because it doesn't lead to anything. 
But, uh, silly me, I looked at the map and I saw, hey look, there's a bunch of hero statues here. Because my map is low res to the point where I can't actually tell that there's stumps blocking them. Okay, I'm just leaving and coming back. I don't want to deal with you. Good. I might have earned back the amount of arrows that I spent to kill the enemies. I don't know. Where did this go again? This just leads to... Yeah. So there we have a level that requires a ladder, and there we have level A, which is complete goddamn bullshit. Um, I'm curious, though, if I... I'm gonna get that money, and then if I... If I don't die first, hold on. God. <laughs> Why are there so many enemies? <laughs> Thank God for the shield. I'm gonna try to go into the level and save and see if it actually remembers that I saved in there. I think the readme said that the optional levels, or like the lettered ones, don't actually have continue points. I don't remember. Because if it does, then I can save and I can try to get through it. And then if it doesn't work, then I can just reload. I mean, I can do that anyway, but then I'd have to, like, walk all the way back and I don't want to be bothered. Either way, I want to blow it up, so... Okay. Saving. Oops. No, 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 not resetting. Not resetting at all. Okay. Saving. And... Beginning of the game. Okay. So... We filled out the map a bit. How have I still not been on that screen? That's really annoying, actually. Um, yeah, I, I'd, I'd like to be on that. I'd like to fill out that screen. <laughs> That's going to bother me. But I don't have to do it right now. This one, you just can't reach, I don't think. You have to swim to it. I, I want to know why all these houses are everywhere. It's, I guess it's because it's a layer on this screen, so it's like applying it to all the other ones or something. I don't know. But yeah. Swamp Island, I guess, needs to be done next time. At this point, I'm freaking too far into the video to start anything. I could get there and save, but... Yeah, you know what, let's just do that. I'm gonna go ahead and guess that it gives me the ladder, because the ladder is useful in the swamp itself. And... God, what other item would it give me? I would love for it to give me the hammer, but I'm not that optimistic. Um... Probably not the hook shot either. I don't know. But yeah, we can at least get into the dungeon. Um, would like I'm I'm debating if uh, I'm debating if I want to check out level A again off screen or if like everything should be shown in the videos like would people care if I went in there and tried to get through it on my own like obviously if I if I find that I can make progress I'd record it but in terms of just like scouting the place out I don't know hmm Where's the dungeon at? Once again, I can't tell where anything is because my map is too small. I mean, I've 
screen wrapped. I'm on the other end of the map now, but uh... Okay, there's the shop. So wait, from the shop... I want to try to go up two screens, just to fill out the map. So I want to be north of here. There's not going to be anything on the screen, but I've got to check it just to be sure. Oh, there is, actually. I can get money from that. That's something, at least. And is this a raft path that I've taken? Hold on. Uh, yeah, this was the one that I... Is it? No, hold on. I'll look at that in a minute after I get out of this place. Oh, whiz robes! And I can't look at the OBS window because they disappear too quickly. Or rather, they appear too abruptly. Wasn't that all of them? Are there wall masters? Of course there are. Spike trap rooms. I've grown to love these so much. I never really had a problem with spike trap rooms before. That last one just freaking was awful, though. With the ice in the middle. No! No! Do I continue from here at least? Okay. Ooh, I get to kill all the wizards again. How much did it, 4 HP on these fuckers? I thought they had less than that for some reason. At least they're not blue ones. The blue is robes are just freaking awful. Even with good equipment, they're probably my most hated enemy in the game. again because this is this is what we want to do and now we try to not die again okay I really should be able to get past this one without that much drama let's juke it then go to the bottom go go whatever Oh god, I almost got hit again. Ugh. Okay. Let's see. Move this up because it's in the way. This is bombable. Move this up because it's in the way. This one I want to put over here, this one over here. I'm trying to make sure I'm not like doing these out of order. Yeah, this is fine. This is just 50 rupees, right? That's what these always are. Yeah. Not really worth it, but I mean, I kind of want to complete all these just for the sake of it. So, whatever, it was, it was something. More than I can say about level A. And now uh, with that done, did I already take this raft path? Is this the one that I did? This screen wraps, yeah, okay. Let me check this out real quick. No, this is new. Okay. What is this? Oh. Okay. I didn't realize that I never went down from here. Here, let me show where this is. Uh, this is up here. Back to level A again. We've come full circle. Yeah, it's just down from this path. I didn't realize I never went that way. Okay, well, the world is a bit more connected now. That's 
something worth celebrating, I guess. Um, let's go back. Get hit, of course. Also, I'd like to point out, um, when I go up from this screen, it keeps the Swamp Island music and palette, and yet when I, uh, like, go down from here, it keeps the Big Ocean palette. I know why it's doing that, because there was no DMAP transition put in, but I don't... Okay, no, actually, never mind, I know why it is. I was about to say, I don't know why it was programmed that way, because that seems like an easy fix, but um, if you pay attention on the actual world map, because I'm all the way on the far left, um, and this warps me to the right, this has to be a side warp, and you can only have one side warp designated per screen. Um, so if I go up from here, it just has to be a regular screen transition. It can't actually tell me to put me on a different day map, so that's why it's doing that. There was another raft path I took earlier that did something similar. I assume it's for the same reason. I don't remember where that one was. It might have been this one, actually. I have definitely got to map out these new areas. Or make my minion do it. I like having a minion. Not to be confused with my informant. My minion and my informant are two different people. Where's the dungeon? Gonna wander around. Where's the dungeon? That was a good song. I call it my Where's the Dungeon song. Where the hell am I going? It's near this at least, right? Okay, hold on. Trying to not have to constantly stop to zoom in on the map. Yeah, here we go. It's near this at least. Wait, is it? Yeah, there it is, okay. I just have to go around. Wait, how far do I have to go around? Because I have to be on that island to my right, and I can't reach that. Um, see, I, I was going to be like, okay, I'll get to the dungeon and end the video, because I thought it was going to be a quick process. It is anything but. Um, this is... This is definitely taking a while. Okay. I need to get to the shop, which is all the way on the other end of the map. Um, Jesus Christ. This is why having the ladder would be extremely useful, because I can probably go over these frickin' small gaps. Wait, can I just go around this way? Yeah, okay, and then take the shortcut here. Okay. This is what we needed to do. It only took me 19 days to get here. And then I blow myself up with the super bomb, or the like likes eat my shield, one or the other. It, 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 one of those things is gonna happen. I, I can frickin' feel it in my bones. Um, okay. There we go. Don't get frickin' attacked. Make it into the level. Save, for the love of God. Cancer. That, de that describes this video pretty well. We'll hear more of that music later. Okay. Yeah. Frickin' done with this for now. My God. I usually like recording this game. This one, I'm not actually, like, that pissed. I'm just kind of, like... The, the experience has made me older and wiser. I have to uh, realize that this game is full of shit, and I really, really need to get some better equipment, and I don't know how I'm going to do it.
but we'll, we'll get through it somehow.